guys, it is Shadow or Austin here, and welcome back to Pokemon Light Platinum. So, the Professor Oak thing is coming up. If you don't remember, last episode we caught two new Pokemon, uh, Aqui or Wooper, and Taxo or, uh, Tox, not Toxo, Krogunk. And I got everyone up to level 10 or higher except Aqui. Aqui, I need to work on a little more, but... I got Toxo to level 10, Electricate to level 10, Caesar still at level 13. I don't want to get him too far ahead, so I kind of stopped leveling him up for a little bit until the others catch up. But they're almost caught up, so I think I can start using him whenever I want again. I believe I took out the rest of these trainers, and I'm pretty sure if I'm yeah, right here, here's the event. So let's get it. Let's get right to it. I believe that's Ash. Or if I see Kenta, be about certain season. They appear by thousands at this time of year. Although they are brave, they are rarely attack people. Rarely appear in the other times. Oh, this isn't even Ash. Very interesting, Professor. Thanks for the tip. I think I'll try the catch one. Hmm. What's going on here? Wow, amazing, Professor. I've fallen in love with these Pokemon. I'll catch one right now. Go, Pokeball! Wow, I captured a Feebass. Looks like a good Pokemon. What? That Feebass is attacking me. Professor, I'll save you. Ah, uh, Kent, are you stupid? What? Is this guy going to be our rival? That's why I kind of gave him a douchey voice. I could catch it. Aqui! Water gun! Yeah. That didn't do much at all. Water gun! Yeah. You know what, for the heck of it? Oh, should I kill it? Well, if we don't kill it in this next move, I might catch it. We killed it, alright. Please level up. No! Oh, thank you. It's Austin. Professor Jasmine asked me to, to tell you that she's doing important research on the creation of the universe and needs your help. She wants to show you her results. She's in her lab in Yellowtown. Thank you, Austin. I'll hear. I'll head there right away. Oh, and this is my nephew, Kenta. I thought your nephew was Gary. Oh gosh, it's getting weird. Nice to meet you, Austin. You look like a skilled Pokemon trainer. I hope I'll face you myself someday. I'll say the same to you. Well, I'll be on my way now. Thanks, Austin. Goodbye. Alright, I don't know if this is going to be my douchebag rival or not, but I'm trying to give him a douchey voice. Am I supposed to go all the way back to Yellowtown now? Come on, can I ever catch a break? Ooh! Shoot! Oh gosh, guys, I swear. No! I forgot, how does Milotic evolve? If Milotic evolves by a uh, water oh, not Milotic. Uh, hold on, I'm searching that real quick. Alright guys, never mind. But I do tell you this, if I find an Eevee, I'm getting a dang Vaporeon. I guess we have to head all the way back to Yellowtown. So if that's the case, I will see you all in the next cut. Yo, okay. Okay, guys, welcome back. We're here at the lab. Here's prof the both professors. Hi, Professor Oak. Welcome to my lab. Thanks, Professor Jasmine. Austin told me I had to come here. So I'm here to learn about your research. Yes, Professor, with Austin's help, I've been studying ancient writings about the creation of the universe. They said Arceus created the world and all the Pokemon. 
Incredible! This is actually related to my latest research in the Pokemon DNA. It seems all species have the same small trait in common. Yes, Professor! Right now, that's all I know! I'll send you the full document on a CD! Okay, Professor Jasmine. I'm gonna do my research on Zeri. Central City's radio tower. Let me know immediately if you have any problems. Okay! Good job, Austin! I've registered you in the Zeri League! I can find the fight the gym leaders! Become a powerful trainer! Congratulations and take care! Team Steam's still after you! Can I grab another Pokemon? Please? No! I had to come all the way back here for nothing! Well, actually, no. The registration means a lot. So now I can compete. Uh, I was hoping there'd be another Pokeball here. I guess you should talk to Mom, just in case. Don't want to forget that. Hello, Mother. Oh, come on! I swear, if she, if she comes out... Once we go up here. No! We still don't get the running shoes, are you kidding me? I have to walk all the way back. Gosh dang it, game! Why do you have to do this to me? I just want to get out of this force. Oh, I haven't ran into any Pokemon. Yes! Now where do I go, though? I don't have a pass, so I can't. Can't go to the train station. Maybe I can go to the side now? Since I am registered? I didn't even get Pokeballs! That's BS. Alright, we can go over here now, though. Let's walk through the grass, see if we can find any Poke. Oh, here's a Pokeball. Dang it! Oh, a Caterpie. Don't need you. Run! Ooh, a rare candy! That could really come in uh, useful. Dang it! A Shinx! Eh, not really interested. Not really interested in a Shinx. Run! Alright, what do you different routes you can find different types of Pokemon. Knew that! Nothing new to me. Whoa! What's going on over here? Okay, a Skunky versus a Combi. Who's gonna win? <laughs> Alright. Combi's come back with some tackles. Oh, that was very funny. Go away. No! No! You're blocking my way! Dang it! When I finally thought... When I finally thought I could go... Things just... They just stop in my face! I guess I go to the radio tower now. Hopefully. Come on. Stop hitting things. Yes, it's open. We can go to the radio tower now. Don't know what's up here, but it's gotta be something. Oh, it's Ash, I think. Or no. This might be, I don't know. Who is this? It's Kenta. Interesting. Oh, hey, Austin. I'm glad you came to my research center. I have a gift for you in Kenta. It's the international, what's the national dex? Which you can use to find in record data on Pokemon during your journey. Alright. Kenta's gotta be my rival. Alright, got the decks. Austin received the national decks. Well, Kenta and Austin, now that with all this tool, you can go on and make a magnif. Ah, oh, I can't speak. On a magnificent journey through the Zeri League. Good luck to both of you. Thanks, Professor. I'll be sure to train hard.
Goodbye, Austin. One day I'll have a great bat. We'll have a great battle. See, I want to hate this guy, but so far he doesn't seem bad. It's just one of those guys you want to hate. All right, now can those people stop fighting? I just want to get through. I really want to fight Kenta though. Why can't I get the running shoes? I wonder if I could buy Pokeballs now though. Next episode we'll probably be challenging a gym. It's taking a while to get to that point though. Let's buy. We still can't buy Pokeballs. Dang you, I have that one Ultra Ball. Luckily I already have four Pokemon, so. Oh, why can't I just have the running shoes? If I had the running shoes, this would be a lot better. I have to walk. Ugh. Come on. You can make it. It's right here. There we go. That guy just appeared in out of nowhere. Oh, great! These people are spread out now. Hopefully I can get Wooper to level 10 now, though. Oh, these are- Ah, oh, these guys have so many Pokemon. Water gun! Alright, here we go. Why is Wooper so slow? Why is it- He still hasn't learned another move. Water gun! I guess after these two trainers, we'll end off the episode. Come on, yeah. Beat him up. Yes, yes, yes. Here we go. Alright, level 9. He's getting close. Oh, well, never mind. He's already there. He's at level 10. Yay! Everyone's at double digits now. Might as well keep going. <laughs> Water gun. There we go. Same shot in me. I don't care about the speed. One more. Yeah, I want to make sure everyone's ready for this gym. So I'm glad they're all at double digits. Combi. Uh, for the next battle, I think I'll either use Elekid the whole time, or Kroga. Alright, my evasiveness fell. Alright, another water gun. Come on. There we go, we're getting there. Oh shoot! That ain't good. Uh, where am I have to go to Taxo here? Can use Gust on us? Dang, this guy! Mud slap. This combi is pretty strong. And these voice cracks, though. It doesn't affect. Okay, we're gonna have to switch out again. Uh, Ele Elekid. Good thing I switched out, it would have killed my program. There we go. Now we can quick attack and get this over with. Thank you. Alright, combi again. We're gonna stay out to Elekid because it didn't work very well last time. Thunder Punch! There we go. A one hit. There we go! One more trainer to, to go. And next episode, we can hopefully challenge Gym Leader. Now we're gonna switch Wooper out for Elekid. Switch to Elekid. There we go. 
Alright, let's get this last battle over with. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, gosh. Look, there seems to be a Pokemon drowning in the water. What is that? Uh-oh. Oh, it's a Pichu. That's drowning. I'll save it. I will save it. Come out. I got it. Can I catch it? Well, I'm glad you're okay. I was a little worried, but it looks like Pichu wants to reward you with a battle. Oh, I'm catching this thing. I am catching this thing. Oh, gosh. Uh, I don't want to one-shot it. Ooh, its defense is probably so low. An Ultra Ball surely should catch it, right? I want it so bad. Alright, guys. I have one shot at this. If this doesn't work, I feel ashamed. Come on! Come on! No! Rip everything! Rip everything! That is not right! It wouldn't have even killed it! Rest in pieces! Rest in pieces! Oh, I could have. Oh my gosh! Ripperoni! This is not happening! I have to kill it! I'm glad that's over with. It's my pleasure to meet you. My name is Diamond. I'm a trainer from the Sinnoh region. I'm in the Ziri League as a rookie, but I'm not on one really. See, let's fight. Gosh dang it! I just killed a Pichu for no reason. Let's fight this douchebag. You know what, whatever. Thunder Punch. I wasted my Ultra Ball on a level 5 Pichu. Drink your Pichu. There we go. Oh, he's just not elegant too. No, I'm fine with that. Ooh, his is a level. See, his is a tick higher. Got that quick attack on though. It's not very effective, bro. Quick attack. Yeah, critical hit. So thunder punch me then. Whatever, one more. No, he used it too. Alright, he's paralyzed though. We should be able to uh, be able to tox. Come on, Toxo. Mud slap. Come on. Come on. No! Toxo! Alright, Aqua, you're our last option. I'd rather not use Caesar. No, I didn't. I just used Tail Whip. You know what? That's fine. Well, let's go to Caesar, anyways. Uh, Vine Whip. Sayonara. Oh, now I'm paralyzed. Yeah, Aqua grew to level 11. Learn Slam. Finally learn something new. Charmander. Oh, no. No. We got a Super Potion Whooper. We got to. My Bulbasaur can't take a Charmander. This guy might be our rival. Holy crap. Use it on Whooper. Alright, let's just get the seed down if we can. Beat seed. No, not again. Dang it. It's up to Whooper. It's up to Whooper Pooper. Come on. Water gun. Alright, he's gonna use Growl. It's fine with me. Smart move by Charmander. 
No, oh, use tail whip. He's gonna ember. Fine with me. I'm gonna tail whip him. I'm gonna water gun him. He's gonna ember me once again. I'm gonna water gun him once again. Yes, yes, yes. No! Yes! Yes! We beat Trainer Diamonds! Well done. You're a great trainer. You deserve my congratulations and respect. Woo! We did it! Oh my gosh. My congratulations on your victory. You really impressed me with your fighting strength. You have a great future ahead of you. I hope to meet you again in the Zero region. I cannot ask for another battle, but for now, goodbye. I am off to challenge the first Zero League gym in the in Horde City. Well, I guess that's where we're going to be heading to after um, in the next episode. If you guys all enjoyed this episode, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, uh, comment, and subscribe. I will see you all in the next episode where we hopefully take on the first gym leader, and peace out.